Thank you very much to the organizers for the opportunity to present here for the third time within this great meeting. Um, what have we done in the past? We have developed a really unique uh, new ocular truck delivery platform and uh, brought last year our first product in whole Europe uh, into the market as an artificial uh, tier product addressing evaporative tri disease. Um, the platform itself, we call it ISOL, is a versatile platform for anterior and posterior truck application. And our pipeline is mainly consisting uh, of advanced cyclosporin A product. It's not a generic to, to uh, make this clear. And uh, omega-3 fatty acid containing product. And we have meanwhile addressed uh, the fields of glaucoma and retina as well. Uh, how does the lubricant um, uh, for evaporative tri eye uh, disease works? As you can see here, it forms a monolayer, a monomolecular monolayer um, above the underlying aqueous phase of the tear film, preventing them from too fast evaporation. And uh, we are addressing really an underserved need here because most of the artificial tears in the market are addressing aqueous deficient tri disease. It's a water-free preservative-free liquid um, uh, with excellent and superior spreading capacities and extremely small droplets coming out of a very low surface tension. So we are talking here about 10 microliter, whereas the water droplet is up to 40 microliters. Yeah, a very successful launch in Europe. Uh, more than 500,000 bottles in less than one year uh, are sold. It's meanwhile in 10 markets, uh, in 10 countries launched. And our exclusive license partner here is the number two player in Europe for eye drops, uh, which is Ursa Farm. Um, this success, of course, is driven by very strong and convincing scientific uh, data from very prestigious tri-eye groups. We have addressed, uh, meanwhile, three different populations in uh, post-market surveillance studies. First, mild to moderate evaporative tri-eye disease. Second, uh, mybom gland dysfunction patients. And the most severe group, of course, coming out of ocular craft versus host disease. And in the first two populations, so mild to moderate and myboom gland, we have improved significant signs and symptoms of these diseases. As you can see here in the uh, graphs, uh, corneal staining and uh, OSDI-like questionnaire, and no relevant uh, safety issues uh, were seen. Yeah, at a glance, uh, very great feedback from the patients, very big success, and even the KOLs stand massively behind saying, we should consider this really new mode of action, which is a physical one, uh, as a new standard therapy for evaporative tri disease. Um, at a glance, our uh, pathway uh, to the main uh, pharma markets in the world uh, just mentioned, we are in Europe in 10 countries. Meanwhile, we will, this is the second track, we will uh, get the approval um, mid next year for omega 3 fatty acid product, which will be a CE marked one in Europe. Um, the registration process is ongoing. We have received feedback from the PDMA in Japan granting us a medical device route as well, and we are uh, in intensive discussions with the FDA, and most likely we go here for a truck approval. I would be happy to share uh, to one or the other after this meeting, uh, of course, the very, very convincing um, scientific data um, recently published um, on the uh, uh, important dry eye meetings uh, this year. And um, coming to further advantages of the technology, so what, what can the ISOL technology uh, deliver with respect to ophthalmic challenges? We can formulate highly relevant um, ophthalmic drugs like latanoprost, uh, cyclosporin, and tacolomus. All of these are considered as really hard to formulate, poorly soluble. We can make out of these crystal clear solutions, preservative-free, water-free, high-spreading, just mentioned, multi-dropping bottles, and if not, we can go for suspensions. And uh, at the right-hand side, you see superior penetration uh, behavior uh, into a relevant tissue here shown with cyclosporin. It's an order of magnitude higher the penetration in the corneal tissue compared to a marketed product. And moreover, we have seen high stability 
capabilities for uh, antibodies for monoclonals, which are relevant in ophthalmology, and we are going for a tropical uh, antibody formulation now. Um, uh, just an overview about our ongoing, almost finalized phase two study here in the US. It's a forearm randomized parallel double mask vehicle controlled study, 200 patients, and we will get the headline data in a few weeks, latest in early January. Um, the omega-3 fatty acid formulation um, is a very special one. You may think it's a emul it's a emulsion. No, it's rather neither a microemulsion nor a nanoemulsion. It's a crystal clear solution with 0.2 milligram per mil omega-3 fatty acids, and we expect the approval mid next year and the launch in 2018, at least in Europe. At a glance, our pipeline divided in an OTC track and in an RX track. So AVOT is, of course, by far the most advanced, approved, and in the market available uh, product in Europe. Very successful upcoming Omega-3 in Europe mid next year. And the RX, the most advanced program, is the Cyclosporin uh, 2 uh, program, uh, Cyclosporin A in a phase 2. Again, it's not a generic, it's a completely different approach, uh, as you can see alone in this crystal clear formulation. And we have addressed, based on this technology in early preclinics, retinal diseases and glaucoma as well. So in summary, it's really an innovative, a disruptive, I would say it's a disruptive technology. Our first OTC product is successfully launched in the two billion artificial tier market. An advanced phase two is underway. And of course, we are happy to go into pharma collaborations as well. We are a very experienced team and we have even strengthened this very successful team with, uh, as you can see here um, in the row at first uh, number one uh, with Christian Reskri. Um, which will be our new uh, CEO as of 1st of November this year. And it's my pleasure to stay on board as a chief, inno as a chief innovation officer and co-founder in this great company. Thank you very much for your attention. Mm -hmm.